guys! It is once again Monday, which means it is time for Making Food Monday, and it is still winter. Ugh, it's just getting into January, which means that it's really good soup weather. And today, I'm gonna make lasagna soup. For today's recipe, we are gonna use bow tie pasta, cottage cheese, mild Italian sausage, ground beef, diced tomatoes, tomato sauce, garlic, an onion, mozzarella cheese, Italian seasoning, chicken bouillon, and Parmesan cheese. And that is all that's going on in our recipe today, guys. First step today, guys, is to get our ground beef, which I have thawed in the microwave, into the pot. We're gonna add the Italian sausage to the pot as well, which means we're going to need to turn the pot on. We're gonna turn that on to our sear roast function to get that browned. We're gonna get the onion sliced. Okay, as you can see, my meat is browned and I've got a little bit of oil, grease, whatever you wanna call it, in the bottom of my pan here. I personally don't think that there's enough fat in the bottom of the pot to worry about. I think it's gonna add a lot of flavor to the soup, but if you're concerned about the amount of fat that's in the bottom of your pot when you do that, certainly you might use a, a ground beef that's got more fat or something along those lines. If you're concerned with that, go ahead and drain it at this point, but I'm gonna add my onions now that my meat is browned. I love my onion chopper, you guys. To not have to do that and cry about it is so helpful. Okay, now that I've got all of my onions in, I'm just gonna mix that around. Let my onions start to soften with the heat of the meat that's already in there. I love this chopper, you guys, because look how nicely diced all these little pieces are. The kids really appreciate how small the uh, chopper dices the onion. Okay, now it's time to add our garlic. We are going to need two teaspoons, which is four cloves of garlic. We are garlic fans. If you're not a garlic fan, you can also take that down to one teaspoon and that's just two cloves of garlic. We like garlic, so I'm gonna put two teaspoons. Next, I'm gonna add two cans of diced tomatoes. There's one, there's two. I'm gonna add one can of tomato sauce. two tablespoons of Italian seasoning. There's one. And there's two. Okay, and then I'm gonna give that a good mix. Okay, there we go. Guys, I have a confession to make. I generally make this on the stove top and it turns out really good. And I thought, I'm gonna make it in the pressure cooker and make it even faster. I've made a small error. I have a full pound of bow ties to go into this pot, and I don't think I have room for a whole pound. So I'm gonna go ahead and use half a pound of bow ties. But there's my max fill line, you guys, and I'm, I'm not, not reaching it yet, but I'm afraid that with this pasta, when it expands, it'll be too much. So I'm just gonna use half the box. And then I'm gonna mix it up and see where we're at. Okay, you guys, once I got it mixed in, there was plenty of room for the whole box. I was just getting a little scared there. I'm still below my max fill line, so the next step is to add water. I'm starting with four cups of water, and I'm going to add until I have reached my max fill line. If you can see my max fill there, line there. I'm just going to keep filling with water until I have reached that line. I don't know how well you can see that there, but at four cups of water, I'm still slightly below my max fill line. So I'm gonna add one or two more cups of water. Let's see how much we can fit in there. Okay, so our max fill line is just under water, which is just what I wanted. So that is five total cups of water that I've got in our soup here. The last thing we're gonna add to the pot is our chicken bouillon. Now, since we have five cups of water, we're gonna need five teaspoons of chicken bouillon powder. There's one, two, three, four, and five. And now we are ready to seal this up. Now I'm gonna set it to the chicken function, which is my high pressure. I'm gonna bring the time cook down to five minutes. The 
because there's nothing in here that's raw except the noodles and they just need to be softened. So in five minutes, those noodles should be good to go. I'm gonna push start. And then in five minutes, I'm gonna let the pressure come down naturally. Pasta can sometimes clog your valve with all the starch that's in it. So you wanna make sure that if you're cooking pasta, you leave it to come down naturally at least for a few minutes um, so that it can kind of take some of that pressure down so that it's not kind of trying to come up that valve. Um, I'm gonna let it come down naturally because I got plenty of time before dad comes home from work and that way the soup will be good to go as soon as dad gets here. My time has run out and my pin has dropped. Now it's time to see what has taken place. Mmm, looks delicious. <laughs> oh, that looks amazing. Okay guys, so the soup is a little bit thicker than I expected it to be, um, which, I mean, I guess I should have expected because I put pasta in there and it's gonna suck up all of the moisture. Anyways, I added just a little bit more water to my pot after I opened it so that I could make sure that it was a little soupier. If you like yours a little thicker, that's fine. You can leave it that way, but I added a little bit of water to mine. If you wonder why mine looks soupier than yours might, that's why. Um, after it comes out, you're just gonna top it with your cottage cheese because it's lasagna. And I'm gonna take a little bit of mozzarella and a little bit of the uh, Parmesan cheese and put those on top too. You could mix the cheeses into your soup if you wanted to, that's entirely up to you. I just like to put it on top and let everybody mix it in themselves. Okay, Mia, I've got it all done and plated it up. All we need now are our guinea pigs. I have a backwards guinea pig. Oh my goodness. Look, I got two backwards guinea pigs. Oh, I think this smells awesome. Yeah. Me too. Who wants to go first? Me. Let's go Jordan first. Yes. Okay, first I gotta mix this up. I don't really like sour cream. That's not sour cream. What is it? It's cottage cheese. Cottage oh. cheese. Because well, it's lasagna. Well, I don't like cottage cheese either, so mix it Well, you, you do if you like lasagna. Mm. Silly, it's in lasagna. This? Mm hmm well, I guess I'm trying. You could also use ricotta cheese, but I like cottage cheese. Ricotta and cottage is on the same. Yeah, be careful. Soft cheese. Nailed it! Okay, let's see. Now it's really hot, but it's so good. You like it? I need a stab and spoon for my noodles. You need a stab and spoon? Oh man, what kind of spoon do you have? A mixing spoon. A mixing spoon, and you need a stabbing spoon? Okay. Hey, there's a stabbing spoon for you. Dad, you can use this one. Are you next? Hey, are you going to taste it? Yeah. Jackson's turn. Hey, that's just noodles. Mm -mm. You. Okay, have a taste. What are these kind? Bow ties. Make bow ties. Yeah. Good? Mm. Good. Yes. Thanks, man. Welcome. Mm. Mia, you're up next. I want Dad to go next. Okay, Dad, you're up next. Oh, yeah, I'll go next. Good. I was hoping that was going to be in your beard. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's super good. It's it tastes like a lasagna, but in a soup now. Mm, that's <laughs> Does good. it remind you of liquid lasagna? That's good. <laughs> hey, Mom. Oh, yummy. Hey, Mom. How many thumbs do you give that, Dad? <laughs> that's good. Hello. That's really good. Thanks, Dad. Meal's turn. Oh, yes. Mix it up and give it a taste. Are you sure? Sideways? Sideways fingers? <laughs> Thanks, Mia. Okay, so my final thoughts. This soup is one of my favorites. I really like lasagna soup. It is actually easier to put together than a lasagna because you have to build a lasagna, and this tastes exactly the same. Um, I did learn something, though. Dad would rather have his soup a little bit thicker, so next time I won't add the extra water that I added. I thought that he would prefer it a little soupier since it's lasagna soup. Anyway, so if you don't wanna add that extra water that I did at the end, you guys might enjoy that a little bit more, too. Um, other than that, I thought it was really, really good. Did you like it? And the my dad 
and noodles. Yeah, you just had noodles because you wouldn't even taste it. And, and there's stuff inside drops. <laughs> I don't know. Don't ask me. But uh, was it good? Yeah. Should we make Should we make noodles again? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we'll definitely be making Let's the soup again because this is really noodles. good. With lots of noodles. With lots of noodles. Who thought the soup was awesome? Me. me. Mia, your hand is not raised. I was so full I couldn't. Finish. Okay, so hold on. I have to ask Mia a question. Mia, do you like lasagna? Did you like this soup? Yeah. So you like lasagna, but you don't like the soup? Well, it was lasagna that. soup, you silly I goose. I said maybe. <laughs> okay, so if you like lasagna, you'll like lasagna soup. If you don't like lasagna, probably not like the soup, right? But I love lasagna. But I love lasagna, <laughs> so it was good. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to make this channel strong, share it with your friends. And now, good night, YouTube. See you tomorrow. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe now. And if you're new here, welcome to our little piece of crew.